Hi, I'm Edouard, co-founder of Koye, a serverless platform to deploy full-stack apps globally using a simple git push or pre-built container. In this session, we will showcase how to accelerate backend apps and databases at the edge combining Koyeb, Neon, and Polyscale. We will use Koyeb to deploy our apps across six locations. Koyeb will take care to route traffic from the user through the nearest edge and core location where the app is running. Neon will be used to run our Postgres database. We will deploy it in the Frankfurt region and we will use Polyscale that will act as a global caching layer to perform reads close to where the application is running to reduce latency. Here you can see the demo that we will deploy in a few minutes, which show how requests flow through the Koyeb network and the latency from each region the app is running to the database and the database cache. All right. Let's move forward and start deploying globally. Before starting deploying our application, we'll need to create a new database and configure the Polyscale cache. To do so, on the Create Control Panel, let's get started by creating a new database service. I click the Create Database Service button here and name my database Neon Dev. Days. I keep the default setting to deploy the database in Frankfurt, as previously mentioned. The database is being provisioned. Under the hood, we are provisioning a fresh new database on Neon. And in a few seconds, I will be able to retrieve the connection string uh, to connect the database. OK, here it is. And so with this information, I can now configures the DB uh, cache using Polyscale, which will require some uh, information uh, to access the, the database. So on the Polyscale control panel, I create a new cache. We we'll name it Neon Dev Days. I choose Postgres as the DB type for the DB host. I retrieve the information from here. And the port is 5432. All right, so we are good. And I get another connection string here, uh, which will allow to connect on the database um, transiting via the Polyscale uh, Edge Network. So next, uh, I go back on the Koyab control panel and I will create two secrets. Secrets are a way to securely store um, sensitive values such as token or connection string. Uh, so I will uh, store here the Polyscale uh, DB URL uh, as a secret value. I pass the connection string and I repeat the same operation for uh, the Neon uh, database. So I grab the connection string here and create another secret Neon DB URL. All right. So we are good and have everything. So we have uh, the database, which is provisioned and running, the database cache uh, configured and polyscale, and we can now deploy the application. So to do so, I go back on the control panel landing page and hit the create app button. The app um, I will deploy is stored on one of my GitHub repository. There it is. And let's configure the service. So yes, I will deploy the default branch. Uh, I will build the application using the Docker file inside the repository. And uh, to deploy to multiple region, I will just change the instance size as on the free one. Um, the, there is a limit to deploy in only one region. So now I'm able to select all available regions. And Last thing is to add the two uh, connection string for uh, Neon and uh, Planescape that are required by our application. So the name of the environment variable uh, for the new one is uh, pgdb URL, and I'm able to retrieve uh, the secrets I previously created, which will inject uh, the secret value uh, to the application. And I repeat the same um, 
with uh, pgh url which is the url we will use to uh, connect the polyscale uh, database all right so all the settings looks good last thing is to name our apps um, that uh, uh, the name of the apps is used to uh, generate the public url uh, to access the application all right so we are good and uh, in a short moment our application will start building so you can see here that i have the um, public url that I will be able to use to access the application. And uh, we see that the application will be provisioned in all those regions. Uh, and basically when the application will be running, when I will hit this domain, I will be um, automatically routed to the nearest uh, location from me between uh, these six locations. So depending where you are in the world, basically you will uh, be routed to, your request will be routed to the nearest uh, regions you are. Uh, so the application is building. With our application running, I can now access the public app domain and I land on our demo application, which is running across six locations. So here I'm able to see our requests are flowing from my location to the nearest Koyeb core location. You can see that I'm at 27 milliseconds from uh, the Paris core location and that this core location is to 11 milliseconds from the Neon database and 8 milliseconds from the database cache. Um, if I scroll down, I have the breakdown for each of the region and their latency to the database and database cache. So basically, when you uh, go to this application, um, you will uh, see how the request is flowing uh, from your location to the Koyeb uh, nearest core location. So depending where um, you are in the world, you will hit one of those region so i hope you enjoyed this uh, demo and uh, have fun and see you soon